Welcome again to the channel. There's a number of ways we can uh, improve internet speeds and I just wanted to uh, take today's episode basically looking at that. Fiber optic broadband is much faster than standard ADSL lines and most people realize that. Uh, but there are other technologies that can be used as well. For example, we can use a microwave link to beam, uh, collect your uh, internet connection from a, a nearby mast. Uh, and if we don't have any masts in the area, in, in fact, some, in some cases it's better to anyway, use a satellite uh, internet connection. Now satellite dish connection typically will run at 20 meg download speeds and around five or six meg upload speeds. The upload speed is actually quite impressive because normally on a standard ADSL line you'd expect a half a meg or, or maybe one meg. Most people only really notice the download speed and that's why the download speed is always seemingly prioritized. You want to know how quickly you can load websites. Well, you're downloading the web pages so that's where you see that. And also if you're um, picking up email and waiting for an urgent message to come through, well then that's being downloaded to you that way. So aside from the download upload thing, really th this video is just about letting you know that there are other technologies available. We're converging a number of technologies. So we might have a standard ADSL line coming in, in addition to a satellite dish, or we might put two or three satellite dishes in to uh, jumpstart a, a, a lease line install. For example, a lease line is very fast internet connection going from anything from 100 meg up to a gigabit and even 10 gigabit shortly. A gigabit connection, we can't really deliver that with satellite dishes because we'd need, well, 50 dishes. <laughs> <laughs> to put it into perspective, a uh, quick bit of mental maths for you there. Um, but what we can do is we can give you 100 meg, and 100 meg is only five dishes. Well, five dishes still sounds like a lot, and it is a lot. Why would you need five dishes? Okay, look, here's the thing. We had a customer recently come to us because they were moving into an, a, a building, and they were supposed to be moving in in three months, but for one reason or another, the business needs changed, and they needed to move in within a couple of weeks. Of course, the problem then is we can't get a lease line installed in, in two or three weeks. So we just turn up with three or four uh, satellite dishes. We link them all together and we deliver high speed internet that way. Um, then once the lease line comes in, we take the dishes away. So there are different ways that we can converge different technologies. We can use radio masks. We've got one customer, for example, who's, who's at the bottom of a country lane so long it's ridiculous and their internet speeds on a standard ADSL line are less than one meg. That's pretty bismal. So what we do is we use a satellite dish to get the signal down to one of their units and then we use a radio mast to beam that signal across to the other unit, uh, which is about half a mile away. So both their, uh, both their industrial units have a decent internet connection as a result, uh, which otherwise would just not be possible. So I think the message to say to you now is that there's a lot of new technologies coming onto the market. For example, 5G. Uh, now, I haven't actually seen any stats as to what, how fast 5G are and if uh, 5G is going to be. And if anyone's got any information on that, please do comment below on the video because I'd love to hear from you. But we do have a number of uh, providers that we are, we're involved with and really, you know, we've seen speeds battered around at 300 meg and 60 meg and all of that, but no real hard facts. And I think it's because it's an emerging technology, so no one can actually give us the facts as a result. Um, but there are, I, I believe, tests starting very soon. So, so hopefully we'll get some real figures through and we'll have an idea as to how much we're gonna see in 5G and how, much, uh, how soon that's gonna be available. And as soon as we find out, you'll find out if you subscribe to this channel. So that was it, it was just a quick chat, just to say, look, there are lots of different ways to connect to the internet. You don't have to use a satellite dish, you don't have to use fiber optic. There are many, many different varieties, and quite often, the best way for you is to converge two or three different types of connectivity and, uh, and, and, and use the right connectivity for the right job. Uh, that's where we come in, so if you've got any questions about that or you would like us to uh, survey you, then please do just drop me a line and, uh, and we'll, we'll be in touch. Uh, all that's left for me to say right now though is thanks for taking the time to watch. <laughs>